What's up guys and girls, it's Alpaca Killer Productions here with a kind of a different video. I'm going to be reviewing our uh, new hot tub, um, but also putting it together because according to the box, quick assembly should take you about six minutes with one person. As you'll find out in this video, it definitely doesn't take six minutes. Um, so it's going to be from the unboxing to the setup and actually a couple of extra bits in between. Um, also as well, um, if you are interested in this hot tub, if you're watching this video because of that, I am leaving two links in the description uh, where you'll be able to get 6.6% .6 cash back on this. Um, so please do use them links uh, if you want to save yourself a bit of money and this is definitely something you're looking from, especially if you're on the website where I bought it, which is all round fun. Uh, also we've got a gardening project going on, so there is going to be a few videos on that. It was a lovely day actually putting it up. Um, but yeah, that was our old hot tub you saw in the background. So I hope you enjoy the video. Make sure you do hit that subscribe button and I hope you enjoy the content. So take it easy people. Bye bye. In terms of what you actually get in the box, you get a bit of cardboard. Um, and the first thing that actually near the top of the box was the filter. So this filter, I'll show you where to put this later on in the video. Uh, there's me looking a little bit confused, but got a nice little simple filter in the box. So you've also got the power lead for the LED lights. Now I'll need to go into a little bit more detail about the LED lights later in the video because that's the only little annoyance that I have with this hot tub at the start when setting it up. You have also got a filter cover. So that is the filter cover that will go on top of the filter once the hot tub is ready to be used. But going back to the LED lights, this was the bit I was about to take the hot tub out of its case and I realised this interesting box and I was wondering what it was and it's actually the LED strip lights so you have to manually fit the LED lights um, on this hot tub yourself so I thought it was actually pre-included um, and already fitted um, in terms of the fitting time that actually I'll show you in the video later but um, I've actually it took me I would have said about 10 to 15 minutes. It is quite a tedious process, but there was me kind of like, oh, there's the LED lights. So reading the instructions, looking very sad, uh, but that was one little downside when it comes to this hot tub. So also you get a little plastic bag with the instructions, a couple of repair kits and um, some extra things that I wasn't 100% sure exactly what they are and I still don't, uh, but that is um, the extra bits there. Now, to get the hot tub out, if you're um, an average person um, like myself, I found it quite a struggle to get it out at the start. It was kind of like, as you see, uh, me sort of having a little bit of a difficulty. So what I did was, easiest way to do it, lay the box down on its side, turn the box, and then lift it out that way. That was a lot, lot easier than actually lifting it um, from that direction. So moving the box out of the way. What I also really appreciated with the actual packaging is you get this little um, sort of plastic cover that actually comes with the hot tub. So keep that to the side, keep that stored in the box that it comes with and that actually allows you to keep the hot tub in a really uh, good condition, especially during winter when it's time to put it away. So what I did was just kind of fold it up and then put it into its box. Now as you see, the hot tub itself is actually one whole unit. That's one of the advantages if you've read some reviews before. There isn't a separate sort of like egg or heater unit. It is actually integrated into the actual hot tub itself, which makes it uh, quite nice. Also an extra thing as well uh, to be aware of is that get yourself a solid base. So there isn't actually a base for it to sit on. So what we did was we bought the uh, Lazy Spa uh, sort of foam protector and what that allows it to do is just sit on a nice base. Um, I think that where I got it from was £40 from Argos and as you can see even though it's nearly brand new it's already got quite a lot of mud. What you've also seen in this video is a very rare occurrence of a male reading instructions. So you also get the uh, M Spa cover. Um, this cover's really, really good. It's got a foil covering as well, which enables it to be able to keep heat in. So um, yeah, really, really good cover in my opinion. Um, also, once it is set up, one of the extra things to be aware of and one thing to budget is that the uh, Spa itself cannot be actually plugged in to an extension cable. So if you've got a plug socket uh, in your house quite near to the window, then great. But what we're having to do is actually have an external socket fitted. Uh, we've had an electrician, uh, we had quite a few different quotes. Uh, the electrician for us has, uh, or is going to be fitting it for 80 pounds, including the parts. Uh, so that's one thing maybe to add into your budget. 
So, so far into this video, I know this video currently we're five minutes into it. Um, for me, this is probably about 30 minutes into me actually making it and I'm finally at the stage of allowing it to inflate. So it's a very, very easy process. There's a um, sort of knob on the side that you then turn on to on and then you hold down the bubble uh, button. So there's me just making sure that it is actually starting to inflate. Um, so there's nothing else special that you need to do during this process apart from stand there like an idiot while it inflates. So once you've got the hot tub inflated, um, undo your cover, have a look at it, but I really like it with the actual foil setting because that's gonna enable you to keep in the heat and hopefully keep the actual cost of the hot tub uh, down. I just wanted to make sure that it fitted and it was working correctly, and of course it was. Uh, very, very easy mechanism. It's just basically a big zip uh, that you go around. You can also, additionally, it comes with a padlock. So therefore, if you want, if you've got children that you're worried about going into the hot tub and being unsupervised, then that's a really good um, sort of uh, addition as well. So uh, yeah, nice and easy to set up on the actual lid itself. So last but not least, now um, we're probably about 25 to 30 minutes into setting up the hot tub. Uh, and if you remember rightly, when I showed you right at the start of the video, this is meant to be six minutes for uh, one person. Um, I don't believe that, but I mean, if you're a super DIY person and you probably got your brain switched on a little bit more than me, then you might be able to do it in that six minutes. But I would love to see the video of them unpackaging it and putting it all together, including the LED lights in six minutes, be some sort of like Superman video. So I'm gonna just speed up the last part which is actually me putting the LED lights in and you'll see how painful it was. It took me roughly about another 15 minutes to get them in. So where you're looking at is these uh, sort of areas um, which slightly raised and you actually uh, sort of push the LED lights uh, through. Once you've done the full circle, it's actually quite nice and easy. It's just the pain uh, to actually get them all the way round because what they wanted to do was keep twisting and that was a little bit frustrating.
So with the last part of this video, I just wanted to show you what it looks like actually in the night with the LED lights. Um, you can't actually change the colours on these LEDs, but I think it actually does look quite nice. Um, M-Spar say it's more of like a breathing slash pulse which helps you relax. So if you're thinking about using your hot tub a lot during the evenings, this is definitely the hot tub for you. So once again, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the content. Um, and if you are thinking about buying this hot tub, remember to use the uh, link that I put down below. Uh, follow it to the... Um, all round fun and you'll get 6.6% off uh, the hot tub in cashback. Um, you can try and find them cheaper but this uh, was £650 um, new and of course with the top cashback got a little bit extra on top. So thank you very much for watching people, enjoy the rest of your week and I hope um, you enjoy the hot tub if you do buy it. So thank you very much, bye bye.